the season over. And Tampa Bay obviously going to be making make some changes. And they've had guys make the team point and Joseph, young guys, uh, strong summers. How much motivation does that kind of add going into your summer? Yeah, I think that's huge. I mean, uh, my off season is going to be huge this year. Uh, I think it's probably going to be my biggest off season yet. So, I mean, uh, I want to have a good off season and come into camp ready to go and ready to compete for a job there. So, do you think you must feel like you're right there, right? I mean, right in the cusp of being able to jump up there. Yeah, yeah. It feels it feels like I'm pretty close. I think. I mean, it's tough to say. It's really at the end of the day, it's it's not up to me. It, I don't make the decision. So, I mean, I the only thing I can do is really give myself the the best shot. To, to be successful and have a good summer and go in there and and ha have a good camp. That's uh, pretty much all I can do. Obviously a very successful year for you and for this team. Uh, not the way the crunch wanted the year to end, but when you look back at this year, how would you characterize what this uh, this season was? Yeah, it was, uh, it was quite the year. I mean, we had a... Uh, a great group of guys all year, uh, and there hasn't been much change. Everyone was kind of stuck stuck with us uh, throughout the year. I mean, uh, it was a lot of fun. Uh, we had a lot of fun here in Syracuse. We had great fans here, and I mean, we finished first place in the division. We were winning a lot of games, which was which was really fun. I mean, it, it was just a great year. I mean, I wish we could have uh, done better in playoffs, but uh, it is what it is, and we can move on now. So yeah, you mentioned some of the accomplishments of this team, and what are Maybe what's the thing that you're most proud of of what this team is able to accomplish or or do this year? Yeah, I mean, I think uh, I think uh, this year was big for a lot of guys. Everyone, I feel like a lot of guys made huge steps in their uh, hockey careers. I mean, everyone was from from start to finish. I think got better as a hockey player, and I mean, it's great to see that out of everyone. And I'm really proud of everyone for uh, competing and accomplishing what we could, we, we accomplished this year. I mean, everyone had had a great year, and it's uh, really good to see that. And I think everyone will be be fine in the future. And we know we've talked about it throughout the course of the year, the the success you had this year, 82 points, and, and just the confidence level that you had going into the start of this season. Uh, when you look back at this in terms of what you did, what do you think? was was the key yeah I uh, I mean I think every year I just keep on getting better and better and that's that's what I try and do every day here and I mean I, I think this year was no different I mean from last from last year uh, the start of last year I wasn't uh, nearly to what I am today I mean I can see the difference I made huge strides I think and uh, I think I just got to keep on doing that and keep on trying to get better here so personally what are you most proud of, of what you've did whether it's the success in terms of the points or just where you got better what are you most proud of from yourself uh, I'm just proud that every day I I think I went in grinded grinded it out and tried to try to get better I mean it's a pretty big accomplishment for the points and stuff and I mean but we had a great team here anyone anyone could have done that I mean it's uh, it was just it was just a really fun year and I'm proud for of all the guys and, and myself as well so it's a young team obviously you're one of the young guys but you've been around for a few years at least uh, going through this playoff experience how do you think it'll help this uh, this team moving forward next year and beyond yeah I think uh, I think we'll be ready. I mean, the last two years we ha we had uh, some good playoff series. We Rochester and Toronto the year before, and this year Cleveland. So I think we're going to take everything we can from all those series and try and uh, help us in in our career, no matter where where anyone's playing. Or I'm sure there'll be some change next year. So it, it doesn't matter where you're playing; you can really take that and use it use it for the future. So it was your second year here in Syracuse, and don't know where exactly you'll be next year. You're and like you said, to, to be in Tampa. But what's it like to, to play in this city and, and uh, in this this building with these fans? Yeah, I mean, this building's uh, amazing. The fans have been great all year. They they support us. They're loud. And, I mean, uh, I've been part of some teams where we haven't had the greatest fans, and it's tough to get up every night and play. But here, I never had an issue here. Everyone's been been so great. They're loud. They, they really uh, cheer us on. So...